Hey everyone, I recently painted and made over a little tykes car that I'd purchased for Cadence at a yard sale and I had people asking me how I did it so I thought I would make a video. I took some pictures along the way and just wanted to show you what I did in case you come across a great deal like I did and wanted to make it new again. So I purchased this little tykes car for $10 used and it obviously was very faded, it had been kept out in the sun, and it was a very simple project to bring it back to life. The supplies that you'll need include a plastic tarp, a water hose with a spray nozzle, some old towels, some sort of cleaning solution, a screwdriver, and of course the paint. The first thing you'll wanna do is take the car pieces apart. It's very simple, there's actually only two screws holding the hood from the bottom part of the car and they're located right in the back and they were very easy to take out. Once you do that, the hood pops right off as does the door to the car. Next, you'll want to spray the car down with a water hose, get all of the dirt. This particular car had some nasty hidden gunk in it. It actually smelled really bad. So I really had to hose it down. In addition to that, I wiped it down using the cleaning solution and cleaned it up the best that I could. Once the car is all dry, you'll be ready to paint it. So you'll want to spread one of the plastic tarps out. Try to avoid using the grass. I learned last week that it kills the grass. And now we have a lovely brown patch in our yard. You'll want to spread the tarp out and put the three pieces on there. You'll want to cover up all the wheels, the steering wheel, the parts that you do not want painted. And I found that using aluminum foil is actually very easy. It molds to all the parts and it stays on very well. So I'd recommend using aluminum foil to keep those parts paint free. Now be sure that the spray paint that you purchase is made specifically for plastic. If it's not, it will not stick to the plastic and eventually will peel off very easily. So be sure you buy the right kind of spray paint. Then you'll wanna just spray the car and coat it really well with the paint. You'll probably wanna spray it uh, be sure you check all the different angles and look at it in the sun and just spray it as well as you can. Once the car is completely dry, it's very easy to reassemble just with the two screws. I was able to use the exact same screws that I had taken out, put the pieces back together. At that point, I went and got Cadence and brought her out to show her her new red car. Of course, she loved it. She was wondering where her pink car went. Pink car meaning the faded red one from earlier. But once I explained it to her, she was really happy and it's her new favorite toy. So I hope this video has been helpful to you and that you'll be able to make some toys over in the future. Bye.